All right, well, our first guest is starring in the new Hallmark Channel original movie, Jingle Bell Bride. Please welcome back the awesome Julie Gonzalo. Welcome back, Julie. Hi. Hi. Good to see you. Visiting us from Vancouver. It's a little bit chilly there. But it's All right. funny. Well, we appreciate beautiful. it. Yeah, that's right. Well, okay, so we got to talk about this movie. Uh, you play the wedding planner in search of a very rare flower, and your character yes. may find more than she bargained for. So take us through it a little bit here. Yeah, so I play a, uh, a New York City wedding planner, and I have been working on this celebrity wedding. And uh, she really wants this rare flower that is only being grown right now in Alaska at the time. So she flies to this little town of Tapisa, Alaska, and uh, the guy who ends up helping her finding this flower is the wonderful Ronnie Rowe Jr. And, uh, and then some things happen that, you know, she needs to stay in Alaska for a few days longer. And, you know, things, things happen, sparks fly, and she finds a lot more than she, she, she expected especially in, in this town celebrating Christmas and, and how the tradition in the family, it's just, it's, it's, it's wonderful. Well, we have a clip of the movie and of your characters in the flower shop, and they're not exactly on the same page quite yet. Let's take a look. Mm. Here we are. Oh. Huh. They're a lot smaller than I thought they'd be. You could always back out if you want. No hard feelings. No, 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 no. I want them. Let's pack them up. Okay, well, they need to be individually clipped, wrapped, and hydrated. Okay, okay. I just need to be on a plane out of here in a little over an hour. Okay, well, we better get a move on. Mm -hmm. um, so how many sprigs did you need? About uh, seven? Seven? Mm. Like seven maids of milking seven? Uh, like seven swans of swimming. Is that not enough for a bouquet? No, it is. It is. It, it, it is. Um, I just, I need enough for boutonnieres and an archway, not just a bouquet. Oh, okay, well, M Margaret didn't mention all of that. Well, the nature of negotiation, one starts low, the other one starts high, you meet in the middle. Aww. Uh, <laughs> oh, I love watching you watch it. Yeah, it's fun it to see such your face, a cute yeah. movie. <laughs> It was fun to it watch you watch super yourself. It was cute. You did such a great job, and you guys are very good together. Yes, yes, it was fantastic. It was kind of like I, I've had the best time working with Ronnie. It, it, he's, he's great. He's, he's such a professional, and, and we kind of got along so fantastic. It was, it, it was nice to just kind of really connect with someone on, on so fast, you know, especially these movies that you're kind of thrown into it, and, and. Uh, no, he's wonderful. Yeah, and I, he's one of the reasons you enjoyed making this movie so much. I know this is your yeah. fifth Hallmark movie, but it's your yeah. first Christmas movie, and it was really special for you. Ronnie wasn't just the only reason that this movie was super special. Yeah, it was really special in the sense that I have never done a, a Hallmark movie, a, a Christmas Hallmark movie, and I, the, the amount of love that is being put into these films and, and dedication to the to the to the sets and and to a wardrobe and everything I, that was really cool, great and it was Ronnie's first Hallmark movie ever so to us that was really special because I got to be in his first Hallmark and he's on my first Christmas Hallmark so it was it was it was really lovely it was it was nice well um Ronnie has a little something he'd like to share with you take a look <gasps> I just want to say that working on my first Hallmark movie with you was such an amazing experience. Um, right when we first met, it was uh, just just so much fun. Uh, you made the process so enjoyable, uh, so easy. Um, you're such a talent, um, and more importantly, you're such a, a great person. And I, I appreciate everything that you put into this and um, into our newfound friendship. Oh, <laughs> it's amazing, isn't it, Julia, how on set when you connect with a co-star, I mean, you know, you work together probably for around three weeks, but it could be a friendship that you have forever. Absolutely. I talked to him this morning. Yeah, yeah no, he's, 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 he's a friend for life. Absolutely. We, we really connected. Um, he's come to my home. I, I will definitely go to his when I, when I visit him in Toronto. I, yeah, it's, he's a really genuine, authentic human who I found him to be the most positive um, person to be around, especially on a job. And, and every morning he, he just, 
he has such a beautiful uh, outlook of life that it, he's he's truly inspiring. And oh, it's so wonderful now to have him as part of our Hallmark That's family. That's right, absolutely. Yes. You okay, guys now. are very lucky. Yeah. He needs to keep working nonstop for you guys. Oh, he will for sure. <laughs> We've been speaking a lot about Christmas, of course, with the movie and everything. Mm -hmm. And here we love to talk about Christmas traditions. I know you have some special family traditions that you look forward to each and every year. I do. You know, it's actually quite different now. Um, I've been in Vancouver for, for a bit because I, I work on a show out here. Um, but I grew up in South America. I did the first nine years of my life in Argentina where it's summer. So we had a lot of different, obviously different traditions in, in, in either pool or beach or just family gatherings because it's your summer vacation. Um, and then I, I moved to Miami where it's still summer, summer. <laughs> technically. <laughs> it's, it's never really winter. So the last few years I've actually had white Christmases. So it's a little, it's flipping. It's, 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 it's nice to have the difference. Um, but yeah, there's, there, I definitely learned a lot more in this movie that I don't have enough tradition. <laughs> so I, <laughs> yeah. well, well, you know, there are two members of your family that we have to mention before we go. And those are your amazing rescue dogs, Charlie uh, and Bowie. And I know always. during these times, they have been nothing but stability in your life. Yes. Absolutely. They're a joy to be, to, to have them, oh to, yeah, a little bobo. They're a joy. They're, they're absolutely a joy. And they're in their terrible twos right now because they're twins, because there's the same litter, uh, and they're, they're about a little bit over two years old. So they're, uh, they're a little crazy sometimes. <laughs> uh, but even still. And actually, my, my mom is uh, adopting a dog this week, and oh. I've been talking to her. She's in Florida, so we're, we're, we're searching shelters and different places where she can go and meet meet her little companion. Absolutely. Well, in honor of your movie, we want to make sure that Charlie and Bowie also have a Jingle <laughs> Bell of their own for the holidays. So we got you. Look Some colors, yeah. So we can hear them coming. Oh my Merry goodness. Christmas. <laughs> yeah. They are going to be the chicest dogs in town. Yes. Little Jingle Bells. All we ask Perfect. is that you- I'll send you my address here. And yes. they got matching. You got two greens and two reds. There you oh, go. Oh, sweethearts. Thank you so Just much. Just take pictures and send them to us because we love Absolutely. to show everybody else. Make sure they wear them while they're screening the movie. <laughs> Absolutely. Yeah, well, the movie's, the movie's soon, this week. You know, it, it, yes, it airs on, on Saturday. Looking That's forward right. to it. Thanks for joining us, Thank Julie. Thank you, Julie. Uh, be sure to Thank watch. you for having me always. You got it. Be sure to watch Julie and Jingle Bell Bride this Saturday, October 24th at 8 p.m., 7 Central, right here on Hallmark Channel.